It would become unsafe to fly if the government shutdown continues. That's according to some people within the industry. New at 530, Action News Jack's Courtney Cole reports most federal plane inspectors are not considered essential workers during a shutdown. It's not a one-day problem. It's not even a one-week problem. But over months, it, we're losing a great bit of experience. Local airports around the country have been forced to do without the experience of safety aviation inspectors for the last three weeks now. Aviation expert Randy Reap told Action News Jax these workers are responsible for making sure your airplane, including parts and processes, are repaired and operating properly. And that is the communication that doesn't happen between commerce between businesses and that's why we have the oversight and that can save future accidents from happening. While air traffic controllers and TSA agents are considered essential workers, somehow many aviation safety inspectors are not. Reap says it's not unsafe to fly right now, but the longer planes go without oversight, the more dangerous it could become. Right now, some aviation safety inspectors are only getting called in for certain assignments, as done in previous shutdowns. We are working to find out how many inspectors are affected at JIA. A union representative in Central Florida says 200 inspectors have been affected. As you hear the people that are in it every day, the FAA union, the pilot union and others saying, hey, we need this resolved. This is affecting us um, from a safety standpoint. When those people are ringing that bell, sounding that alarm, we need to take that seriously. Reporting in Jacksonville, Courtney Cole, CBS 47, Action News Jax.